All right, guys, quick little demo uh, on the Nocta triple score. I want to show you guys something in regards to the recovery speed. Now, if uh, for those that follow my channel and follow my videos, you know that I've recently put one out uh, in regards to uh, brand new settings for iron infested sites for the Nocta triple score. I've gotten over 300 test combinations I've done with the triple score both in the field and bench testing to come up with settings that is going to make you and me successful out in the field to find silver coins and copper coins and the better conductive relics at depth and in dense iron patches. But on this video, I want to show you one setting specifically, and that is going to be recovery speed. That's going to be your second logo right there, recovery speed. We all know that as you increase your recovery speed, you actually lose depth, and that is on any metal detector. It's the same with the triple score. It goes up to five, and the lowest setting is one. With one, they say one is great for sites that don't have a lot of debris and not a lot of iron. It gives you maximum depth, but to compromise, you have a slow recovery speed. But it doesn't matter because there's not a lot of iron debris at that site. Iron infested sites, you would think that you would need a five to be able to find that stuff that I've talked about in iron debris. I got a test here and we're gonna take a look at something. I'm gonna set the recovery speed at five and have a look down here. I have a silver dawn, guys. There's a half inch, a half inch, the width of your pinky finger in between the iron debris and the silver dime. You'd expect that I would re need a recovery speed of five max to get that coin in iron. What do you guys think? Watch. You sure do. I'm gonna keep the same height, guys. So let's do this. About four inches, okay? Recovery speed five, silver dime, half inch. See how you've lost depth? Now watch this. Let's go recovery speed one. It shouldn't get it. Let's go up to five. You can hear it's lost depth, but you're able to find it. Let's go down to one. Eight inches. Let's go up to five. Eight inches. Down to one. Eight inches. That's just one of the tests, guys. Iron infested site settings that I've created for the knock to triple score, they all work collaboratively as one. It just goes to show that if you set it right, even a recovery speed at one, with the minimum space in between a silver dime and two rusty nails, you can still detect the silver dime at depth at a recovery speed one and you don't have to increase this to five to find something like that in the field. You'd think that something that tight together would need a recovery speed of five max and you're absolutely right. Let's run the sensitivity up a little bit higher to 10. Let's see if we can get it. We can. It's about eight inches, guys. So what do you think? Recovery speed one? The lowest recovery speed, guys. Do you think we can get that silver dime that close to iron debris?
You bet. And it's even louder than recovery speed 5. Watch. You can hear it. It's repeating. We're pretty hot. We're, we're about 10 inches here. Okay, recovery speed 5. Now listen. Try my settings out. They all have to work together and I've refined everything to be absolutely perfect for you guys. The recovery speed that I have in my settings is at two. You can go to one if you wish. Two is at that spot where you get the same depth and separation abilities as I've just showed you at one, except it's at two, which is kind of a breaking point. Anything after two, you start losing depth. Two is a nice compromise. It's not the lowest, it's not at the breaking point, it's just right dead smack in the middle at two. So I encourage you guys, don't worry about missing targets with the triple score at a recovery speed of two or even the lowest at one. As long as you have all your other settings set up the way I have it after all the tests that I've done in all the hours, and you will find coins in dense iron debris, no problem. And the triple score, the reason I've done this is the triple score is almost like a baby legend. It doesn't have all the tweaks, it doesn't have the bells and whistles that the legend does, but it has enough to be able to create that same or similar, very similar iron infested site settings on the triple score. It's a great small downgrade from the legend. It's a great backup unit, travel unit. Guys, you set it up and you forget it. Any questions you have, guys, about any of the Nocta products, let me know. I'm more than willing to help you guys out. Thanks for watching.